Death is a reality that we all have to face at some point in our lives. It's not a pleasant thought, but it's a fact. And when it happens, it can leave behind a lot of complications and problems for our loved ones. That's where estate planning comes in. It's a way to ensure that your assets are distributed according to your wishes and that your loved ones are taken care of after you're gone. In this video, we'll be discussing the importance of estate planning and why it's something that everyone should consider. We'll cover the basics of estate planning, including wills, trusts, and other important documents. And we'll also talk about some of the common mistakes that people make when it comes to estate planning. So, whether you're young or old, rich or poor, it's never too early or too late to start thinking about your estate plan. Let's get started. Before we dive into the details of estate planning, let's first define what it is. Estate planning is the process of anticipating and arranging for the disposal of an estate during a person's life. It involves the management of assets and the distribution of wealth after a person's death. Estate planning is not just for the wealthy. It's for anyone who wants to ensure that their assets are distributed according to their wishes and that their loved ones are taken care of after they are gone. The most common document used in estate planning is a will. A will is a legal document that outlines how a person's assets will be distributed after their death. But estate planning is not just about wills. It also involves other important documents such as trusts, powers of attorney and healthcare directives. A trust is a legal arrangement in which a person's assets are held by a trustee for the benefit of another person or group of people. A power of attorney is a legal document that gives someone else the authority to act on your behalf, such as managing your finances or making healthcare decisions. A healthcare directive is a legal document that outlines your wishes for medical treatment in the event that you become incapacitated and unable to make decisions for yourself. All of these documents are important components of estate planning and they can help ensure that your wishes are carried out and your loved ones are taken care of after you're gone. Estate planning is important for many reasons. One of the most important reasons is that it can help avoid family disputes and legal battles after a person's death. Without a clear estate plan, family members may fight over assets and property, which can lead to lengthy and expensive legal battles. A will can help avoid these disputes by clearly outlining how a person's assets will be distributed after their death. Estate planning is also important because it can help minimise taxes and other expenses that can eat away at a person's assets. A trust, for example, can help minimise estate taxes and other expenses by transferring assets to beneficiaries outside of probate. Estate planning is also important because it can help ensure that a person's wishes are carried out after their death. A healthcare directive, for example, can ensure that a person's wishes for medical treatment are respected in the event that they become incapacitated and unable to make decisions for themselves. A power of attorney can ensure that a person's finances and other affairs are managed according to their wishes if they become unable to do so themselves. Overall, estate planning is important because it can help provide peace of mind and ensure that a person's loved ones are taken care of after they are gone. While estate planning is important, there are some common mistakes that people make when it comes to their estate plans. One of the most common mistakes is not having an estate plan at all. Many people assume that estate planning is only for the wealthy, but this is not the case. Another common mistake is not updating your estate plan regularly. Life changes and your estate plan should reflect those changes. For example, if you get married, divorced, have children, or acquire new assets, you should abate your estate plan to reflect these changes. Another common mistake is not using trusts when appropriate. Trusts can be a powerful tool for minimising taxes and protecting assets, but they're not always necessary. Finally, another common mistake is not communicating your wishes to your loved ones. Your estate plan should not be a secret. You should discuss your wishes with your loved ones and make sure they understand your intentions. Overall, avoiding these common estate planning mistakes can help ensure that your estate plan is effective and that your wishes are carried out after your death. In conclusion, estate planning is an important process that everyone should consider. It involves anticipating and arranging for the disposal of your assets and the distribution of your wealth after your death. The most common document used in estate planning is a will, but there are other important documents, such as trusts, powers of attorney, and healthcare directives. Estate planning is important because it can help avoid family disputes and legal battles, minimise taxes and other expenses, and ensure that your wishes are carried out after your death. To ensure that your estate plan is effective, it's important to avoid common mistakes, such as not having an estate plan at all, not updating your estate plan regularly, and not communicating your wishes to your loved ones. Whether you're young or old, rich or poor, it's never too early or too late to start thinking about your estate plan. So take the time to plan for your future and the future of your loved ones. By doing so, you can provide peace of mind and ensure that your loved ones are taken care of after you're gone.